Hi, this is Leonie from Spines and Splines. We usually make DIY videos and pair them with a workout, but today we have a bonus Halloween special showing how to carve a pumpkin into a jack-o'-lantern using a serrated knife, a spoon, a V-shaped lino carving tool and a wide V-shaped lino carving tool. I started writing a bit of a Hamilton inspired rhyme for this voiceover, but only got as far as the first verse. How does a pumpkin filled with seeds and stringy gore and a woman who's never carved up one before make it something that somehow looks a bit like Lin Manuel Miranda in his role as Alexander? As a fresh immigrant in Ireland from Australia, this is the first time I've ever carved a pumpkin. The Halloween pumpkins are much softer than the ones I'm used to from back home, and the lino carving tools worked amazingly well for carving the skin. Links to the tools I used are in the doobly doo below. I carved two pumpkins that I've named Alexander Hamilton and Elizabeth Sculler. I used the V tool to carve the outline for small details, and a wide U tool to clear the large areas and create shading. I've left thicker areas where I want more shadow and made thinner spots that I want to be brighter. And after carving my pumpkins, I toasted up the seeds and made soup from the scooped out flesh. Enjoy the rest of the video. No point to say you can't. I should apologize Got stuck in my throat Or something This is an awkward time Would you prefer a note Or something I've still got 
put your details in a little notebook And I'll compromise on stupid conversation Because I am still quite fond of you Make sure to like, subscribe and share if you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more fun projects from Spines and Splines. Cheers!